Dr. Ryan Goodkin. Today's topic is a metabolic detox. I think there's a lot of companies out there that are probably offering a detox, and I just want to give you some tips and tricks and things to look for, and maybe a general understanding of why you would even consider doing a detox. As a pharmacist, and we've talked about like the hepatic system, the liver, why and how it operates and what it does, and all of a sudden people want to detox, and so it's natural for medical providers to say, wasn't well, that already what the body's doing on its own? Isn't that the job, the job of the liver and the kidneys? Isn't that it? I mean, why would we add more things to it and expect it to just all of a sudden magically detox itself? So thankfully though, there's been some more research done on this topic and it looks like there is some significant amount of benefit. From my perspective, I like the benefit of the sort of food choices, right? The nutritional impact of a detox. Because a detox isn't just, hey, let me take a few capsules that are claiming to, say, increase the metabolism or increase the ability of the liver to metabolize foreign substances. I mean, there are supplements that go along with the detox that can help, say, induce or increase the amount of enzymes used to detoxify. Um, but I would say that's not even really the primary goal of a, of a detox. It's not a food elimination diet, but it's sort of a food selection detox. It's going to allow you to eat more, say, cruciferous vegetables like broccoli and cauliflower focus on lean proteins and healthy fats. And so by doing that, it's gonna eliminate a lot of the junk food. So maybe it's more of a reset. Maybe it's somewhat of a food elimination. Maybe it gets rid of some bad habits. Maybe it gets eliminate some of those cravings that just, you know, we, we can become so vulnerable to. So for those reasons, I do like the detox. I use a detox about every, two times per year, so every six months. Um, there's a few different brands out there, so you should look for something that has, obviously, something that's not doing calorie restriction. That's not what I'm thinking here. I'm, I'd like for you to do something that says, here are the foods, the categories and classes of foods, and eat as much as you want, right? I mean, that's, we're not trying to go extreme. We just want to make something simple. Stay really well hydrated. Understand that a detox is trying to pull toxins and impurities out of your tissues. So with that, there's a lot of work. The body from a cellular level is working really hard. So there may be some fatigue, there may be some times where you feel like there's brain fog and you're just kind of off. But stick with it. Um, I, I have learned that the detox program is a wonderful way to reset. And I hope the same happens for you. I'm Dr. Ryan Goodkin. As always, I welcome your comments and questions below. Also, please don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel and follow me on social media at Ryan Live Good. Thank you and be well.